time. Some of you may have heard of Cicada 3301, while for others, this may be the first time you're encountering the name. As of 2024, the true identity of Cicada 3301 remains shrouded in mystery. Who or what is behind this enigmatic series of puzzles that first appeared on the internet in 2012? Theories abound. Some suggest it could be a secretive group or looking for like-minded individuals. Others speculate it might be a recruitment tool by a government agency or some private corporation. Then there are those who believe it could be an elaborate experiment conducted by an advanced AI, possibly one that has achieved time travel, reaching back to influence humanity from the future. As we delve into the world of Cicada 3301, we encounter a phenomenon that uniquely blends cryptography, philosophy, and global scavenger hunts, challenging participants with its complexity and the breadth of knowledge required to solve its puzzles. Each layer of the puzzle reveals the depth and intricacy of its design, compelling us to question not just how it was created, but why. Is Cicada 3301 a test? Is it a recruitment tool? Or is it perhaps something more profound? A signal from the future disguised as a game? Join me in Timeless Mysteries as we explore the intriguing possibilities surrounding one of the internet's most enduring mysteries. Cicada 3301 made its first appearance on the internet in January 4th of 2012 with an image that concealed a hidden message marking the beginning of what would become a series of increasingly complex puzzles. By 2014, Cicada 3301 had gained notoriety through a particularly challenge, challenging puzzle that was intertwined that intertwined encrypted messages with a global scavenger hunt, clues that were hidden in diverse locations, ranging from telephone poles in Warsaw, Poland, to the bustling streets of Seoul, South Korea. Solving these puzzles required a broad and eclectic set of skills, including cryptography, data analysis, literature, philosophy, even classical music. And there was other things that you just had to know. The design of these puzzles did more than test intellectual prowess. It probed the solver's personal beliefs and ethical viewpoints. The number of people who have fully solved these puzzles remains a mystery, as does much about Cicada 3301. Once someone reported a more secretive phase of engagement combined with the already known depth and variety of challenges attracted even more participants from a wide array of backgrounds, from hackers to, seasons, to seasoned cryptographers and, you know, amateur cryptographers and, you know, people who were just curious and didn't even know anything about how to solve these things, wanted to know how to solve them also. These puzzles are arguably one of the most sophisticated and mysterious puzzles ever to appear on the internet. Now that we've established what Cicada 3301 appears to be on the surface, a complex series of puzzles that challenges the mind and cryptographic skills, it's time to delve into the more intriguing intriguing and speculative dimensions of this phenomenon beyond the rigorous intellectual exercises and the secretive recruitment processes lies a deeper layer of mystery and conjecture about the true nature of the intentions of Cicada 3301. The puzzles of Cicada 3301 are rife with references to esoteric literature, philosophy, and technology, weaving a narrative that suggests more than mere mental gymnastics. These elements prompt us to question whether Cicada 3301 might be an entity or a group 
with a larger agenda. The use of the symbols and texts that hint at societal transformation and enlightenment. You know, there's an, uh, theories that this could work as an organization aiming at, you know, to initiate select individuals into a new ideology framework that could prepare the world for the future. What these global changes might be, you know, I don't know. Speculation ranges widely. You know, I think Cicada 3301 was a think tank project, you know, used to recruit individuals who could potentially solve these, these puzzles. But what if I'm wrong? What if there's something deeper, deeper here? What if it wasn't a government, you know, uh, group? Maybe it was an individual who thought that perhaps they could find a group of people to change the world. Or perhaps it was an AI from the future, reaching back through time, asking questions of humanity to, to keep humanity alive in the future. But the big question still remains, why does Cicada 3301 exist, and to what end? The last known message from Cicada 3301, reportedly in April 2017, has left many unanswered questions about what they might have, uh, why they had stopped releasing new puzzles or communicating further. Various theories have been proposed, but without additional information from the group itself, or the person itself, or the AI itself. These all remain speculative. It's possible that Cicada 3301 had a specific goal set and achieved those goals. And once those goals were achieved, they no longer needed to create more puzzles. If Cicada 3301 is indeed a group with significant skills in cryptography and data security, they might have chosen to go silent to maintain operational security. As their puzzles gain notoriety, it could have become increasingly difficult to operate with attr without attracting unwanted attention from governments and private entities that might not align with their values or intentions. Cicada 3301 could be taking time to regroup and plan their next steps. This might involve creating puzzles that are even more complex or shifting their focus towards different methods of interaction or recruitment. There's also the possibility that external pressures, legal, political, or personal safety concerns force them to, or him, or her, or the AI, to halt public activities as an anonymous entity that has garnered significant public interest, the creators behind, creators I say, or creator, or maybe Cicada created itself, might have faced pressure that jeopardized their ability to continue safely. The current status of Cicada 3301 is as elusive as the identity of who or what it is. There have been no verified communications or new puzzles since, like I said, 2017, leading to a lot of speculation. But it's 2024. I want to see another puzzle. Cicada 3301, if you're out there, I think it's time to bring the puzzles back. Because I'm still curious. I know other people are still curious too. Well, that's all I have for today, A Timeless Mysteries. I hope you enjoyed the content and keep watching. Don't be afraid to ask questions or post your thoughts in the comments. I 
look forward to engaging with you. So please like and subscribe and tell your friends about this channel. And there will be more interesting content coming soon.